Get out Rudy here. Just going to uh, run through how I put my battery packs together. Um, so we're starting off. Uh, start off we use the battery holders. Which you can, uh, oh, buy on uh, eBay. I'll show you the link in the description. Um, so you basically just put them together. Pretty easy. Simple as that. And then what I do, I drill some holes in the first two and the where the joint is, the second one from the end, both sides. And I use that to put some uh, cable ties through to hold all the packs together. This end, you gotta be careful because it can break. Okay, yeah, once I've put all the batteries in, the battery pack, uh, turning the writing on the inside to make it look nice and neat, then what I do is I have these stickers, which are insulated stickers, which I bought on eBay, and basically you just Pull them off and stick them on. Once you get in the routine, it's not too bad. Now the reason I do that is because we have a look at this. If the insulation's slightly damaged, then you can get ooh, little sparks there, little shorts. So if you put those little insulation stickers on. Uh, just gives you a bit more protection. Uh, what I usually like to do is just pull the centre ones out first, it makes it easier. All done. So it's just a matter of pulling them off and sticking them on. Pretty easy. Quite relaxing. Yeah, all done. Yeah, it all looks nice and uniform. And pop this thing on top. A little bit sticky. There we go. Lock of wood. Just knock them down a bit. If you've got different colour batteries, it makes the top all look the same. So it looks quite nice. I've done that one over here as well. I've just got to test a few more batteries to fill up the inside of this one. And then we're done. Okay, thanks for watching. On the next video, we'll go through how we do the bus bars. Cheerio.